Sewers, I'm Colleen Cheely and welcome to FSB TV. Now I'm going to share with you in this short project, it's not going to take very long, a little tip to create those ruched effect sleeves. It's going to be so easy to do, you'll be making loads of these shirts and you're going to need a man's shirt and it has to be a man's shirt that has a double cuff which I'll explain in a moment the reason why. Let's get started. Now I've got this little tip that gives this amazing result and it's going to be so easy to do and I promise there's no sewing involved. Now you're going to need your shirt. The shirt that you're going to need though for this is going to be a turn up cuff. So it's like a, a double cuff. And then you turn it up. And it has that nice kind of wing effect to it so that's the shirt you're going to that's a kind of cuff I would recommend it could be done with a single cuff I'm sure it can be yeah it could be but I just think it looks more feminine and pretty with this effect of the wings so what you're going to need is some elastic now this is cord elastic you possibly could use regular elastic, but I think cord is more finished off, so I would recommend a cord elastic. You need about 10 centimetres, which is about 4 inches. And what you do with these double cuffs, because they have cufflinks on men's shirts, there tends to be four buttonholes. So you've got two there. Just put my nail through there. And two on the other side. Now what you do then is get your elastic cord and you put it through the top buttonhole like so and then you put it through the next buttonhole like so and then you tie it into a knot. Bring that through, yep. And then you just pull to tighten the elastic so that it doesn't move and it keeps tight. Oh, see that is really firm now. So you could actually just leave it like that. You've got this kind of like a little bow effect going on here but what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull it to the inside so I'm just going to put that knot through to the inside of the cuff so that you don't see it on the right side like so and I more than likely would make those a little bit smaller so I'll get my scissors and just click just to make them those little tails a little bit smaller and that is it that is how you create that amazing look of a ruffle sleeve in this very simple little trick so I'm just going to do the same on the other sleeve and that is the effect that you are going to get this enables because it's elastic you'll be able to you know depending on the width of your arm um you may need a bit longer elastic depending on you know the, the, the thickness of your bicep or area around your arm so that is the effect that you'll have and that's what creates those amazing sleeves well i hope you enjoyed that quick tutorial it's such fun being able to share that with you that tip of making those ruffle sleeve it looks as though you put a lot of effort into the project between you and i Yes, you did. So I hope you had a lot of fun making yours. Put it in the comment box below and let me know how you got on. And I will see you next time.